everyone and welcome back to another episode of the Planetary Values Challenge. This one is kind of a little live gameplay mod review because I am a Patreon of the wonderful modder Pandasama and they just early released the newest update to their childbirth mod which allows us to give birth at home which we checked out in this episode. We also aged up and moved out again well the moving out part not the aging up part. anyway um if that sounds interesting to you please keep on watching don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button and let's go but basically yes we have like eighty four thousand dollars technically we could have afforded that other house but we're basically trying to say that this money is in a bit of a trust fund um type of thing that she can access when she becomes a young adult but last, last time, last thing we did was, it was just prom, and after prom ended, the frick ass you mean you, uh, shh. I'll put the door there, can you access it? Serve dinner, find Sally. Yes. Okay, so the last thing that happened was we went to prom. And as soon as we came home from prom, um, graduated Venus from high school because she had the option to get out early. And then moved her in here and then moved Soren in as well. Soren, because he's an NPC, is technically a high school C student. I think he would be higher. Um, so probably, we're gonna see how far I can get him up uh, before he ages up. And if I can't get him to an A student by Wednesday, I will cheat it. I'm not saying like, oh well, you're cheating at the game. Yeah, I know, but it's because the NPCs in The Sims just do not get their own story progression. Like, Soren is very much like Venus in the sense of, you know, uh, in the sense of like very hardworking. So the fact that he's a C student very hard to believe. Part of me wants to, you know. Wait, isn't there a way that you can actually woohoo? Why would you ask your boyfriend if he's single? You know. Well, they better float your boat. <laughs> they didn't even change clothes. Please tell me they're not going to do the glitch. Don't get up halfway through the woohoo section and change your clothes. I will... I will cry. Because that glitch is terrifying. But I think for her cooking skill, we're going to just like work on just cooking. And then gourmet, maybe? And the reason I bring that up is because we need to cook dinner. Um, get you a crown roast. Boiling frog hot pot. What? Anyway, the effect. I almost want to. Except, here's my issue. What if I do that, and then... Do that. Before anything goes down. <laughs> oh, she's pregnant. You already know. If they do the thing where the knees are down, she's pregnant. <gasps> They know they're teens, but they also know that they're they're fine. <laughs> what? No. Yep, 
Yeah, that's the thing that's, like, conflicting, is that they're like, oh no, teen pregnancy. I'm like, no. They're excited. Stop it. <laughs> uh oh. The gremlins really said, uh uh uh. <laughs> Puberty changes? Did his beard grow? His beard grew. <gasps> oh my god! That's so cool! I usually don't have that on, but I think because I did it. Buddy, you gotta go. But because I think I put a little bit of facial hair on him, it turned it on. <gasps> He's such a cute little dude! Um, that one. Because they say you're supposed to do it in your second trimester. Yeah. Because then there's, um, some things that are custom content. Yes. This thing. Which we're gonna want because it has to be on the bed. I'm like, why isn't it working? And then I realized I, shif I shifted the bed. <laughs> Except it says you want a lot of room so that it doesn't glitch. So we may like put this stuff just away. Let's go Soren. Let him take a shower and eat some dinner and then we'll go do the ultrasound thingy. Yeah. What do we got? A girl. Okay, so Gen 3, I can't believe I'm saying we're already on Gen 3. I'm not going to put anything up cuz we're not going to stay here that long. Gen 3 is Saturn, so probably S names is what I'm going to be looking for. Saturn is orange and yellow, so it'll be a lot of the same. But I'm pretty sure we're going to use the youngest, so this one couldn't be anything. And... Wait, it's I do think it's oddly, oddly kind of funny that S names... Soren... So, if we get a boy, I might do a Soren Jr. But this is a girl. And the name that keeps popping in my head is Sapphire. I don't know why, but I like it. So we will rename her to Sapphire Page. That's not spell Page. Sapphire Page. Just because they're not married yet. Can I not? Oh, I, was, I think I was. If it allows me, I'll do this. The first little girl, we're going to name her Sapphire. I don't know. I just think it's cute, and I'm going to dress her in blue because we know. I'm. I don't think I'm going to follow. Everybody has to follow the colors anymore. Just the ones we know are going to be the next gen, and I think our youngest will be the next gen because it makes the most sense to be like oh this house was full yada yada and because then we'll have more time to work on her yeah i don't think he's going to but i will i will cheat it when he gets home because he should have been an a student but again sims progression sucks happy birthday to you you are all alone because i'm asleep hope you have a good day Sorry. Absolutely not. 
a house full of jealous sims. No, I won't. That works. One aspiration. Um, knowledge. That one. <laughs> do, 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 do. Oh. I will add birthday candles. Put it away. Um, job. Find a job. Hey, buddy. Should hurry up. Let's see. He's already on level three. Because of a high school degree? I don't know, Sims. Kind of seems kind of sketchy. <laughs> Merry Christmas! <laughs> Take a shower. Mm. No 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 All of a sudden I'm like What's wrong? Why is what this man has a full grown beard Uh Do you have to pick preferred length? Cause what is preferred length? Cause mine is not that. That is for sure. My preferred length is definitely not that. There you go, buddy. She really popped when she hit labor, huh? <laughs> that is one of my preferred lengths, so you know, it works. Such a cute little dude. And see? Because, um, he's a doctor, he basically can have, like, the doctor role. I'm just gonna, like, look this way because, no, wow, no, there's no walls. No, no, there we go. Wow, lovely. Kalang and Sula, stay well. Bathing suit? Same. Why did they have negative friendship? Bless you. Mm-hmm. Could you imagine giving birth on an air mattress? You know, whatever floats your boat. Is his shirt glitching? It is. I thought he was like, does he have gray back hair? Bless you. I don't like to cry, Ying. Yay! But now we have our first out of five, maybe more. What the? What the heck? Apparently I have a hotkey? I thought I was in my game, I was not. So we've got little baby Sapphire. And we're doing it hyphenated because they're not married yet. Sapphire Paige Akiyama. This is one thing that's kind of still weird and glitchy about the mod. Do it. It's such a thing. That's so cute. Yeah, and see, because he's technically in the doctor career, it's like he was able to do it well with that. But you've got. Oh, I was like, where'd the baby go? You've got to move the baby before you get rid of this stuff. 
Because otherwise the baby gets yeet yoked too. It's okay. So now the last one is family oriented. And it's the same trait, but it keeps going. You need a different one. I'm like, no, I don't. So we add birthday candles. Put it away. Soren, I think you have something to do. Thank you for having our baby. I love you very much. You may Rabuna! Because we've got like a lot of stuff to get through. <laughs> Alright. So now we are going to move household. You couldn't have done it any faster before the baby started crying. What the heck? So this is our new house. The bassinet has changed. <laughs>you enjoyed this video i really enjoyed it i love the mod please go support pandasama any way you can i will be linking both the mod that's like free of access right now and their patron which is the same place in the co in the description below and i will see you all in the next video goodbye